Hello and welcome to the assembly guide for the first mate, which is a yeah tiny little break action pistol, pretty similar to the Corsair. Okay, to start off, we take the trigger, take the barrel here, and we put the trigger in like this. You need to like angle it like that, and then it should just about go in. Move it forwards uh, so the lip is back here. Then we take one of those little pins and put it in like that. May need a drop of glue or as always with my uh, stuff, it's all done with prints. Uh, so you may need to adjust this in your slicer settings by just rescaling. Shouldn't be too much of a hassle, just as a heads up. Then you take the muzzle. You should probably print this in orange but I'm not American and I also don't play any Nerf games, so I can do it in whatever color I like. You also secure this with the same pin as here. You should just push, uh, push in, then it should look fairly nicely. Next up, we take this thing, the grip. I had to change material here because I ran out. Put that in. Now it folds. Okay, next up we take one side of this. Um, I usually do it with the left side, the left, like the side with the pin here goes inwards. Then you take the pin like this, the one with the little end stop, put it through. Then you put that almost through. Take this little lock mechanism, put it in with the spring downwards. I'll show you how it's supposed to look when I got that pin in. So here's the spring, there's the little hook. Then we take this thing, also the little nub on the inside. And then we take our retention ring. This has two little indents. So you basically put the retention ring over those. Can be a little bit tricky. You can also, if you get it positioned, you can take pliers and squeeze them together like this a bit, like carefully, to put it in place. Mine just locked in place like that. And now you already notice when I click it close, it does this really satisfying click sound and it doesn't open anymore until you press it. Okay, to the string process, we want this thing closed, put the string through, and tie a simple knot through that mouth-shaped thing under the muzzle, like this. Then we hold these cords, open this thing, and just give it a good pull so we are at maximum stretch. This thing takes all its power from just having as much stretch as possible in a short amount of time. So we want that as tight as possible while it's back down there. Then we close it by just tying it up. I just noticed I forgot to bring darts. But we'll see if it works without darts as well. Then we just take a lighter, cinch the ends, whoop de whoop. That works. Well, let's see if I can find some darts. Be right back. Open it up. Throw in a dart. Works. Very nice. Will be up on my Etsy store, probably. If not, it'll be on my printables, but I'll probably put it on my Etsy. Right, thank you for watching.